Hi everyone. In this video, I'll show you how to set up C++ in Visual Studio Code. It's super easy, so let's get started. First, we need to download Visual Studio Code. To download it, go to code.visualstudio.com. Just click download. It will automatically detect your operating system. For me, it shows download for Windows. If you're on Mac or Linux, it will show the right option for you. Once downloaded, open the installer. Accept the agreement and click Next. Keep clicking Next and check the box for Create a Desktop icon. Click Next again, then click Install. Once the installation is complete, click Finish and launch Visual Studio Code. To run C++ code, we need a compiler to convert it into a language your computer can understand. We'll use GCC. To download it, open your browser and go to msys2.org. Now, scroll down and click here to download it. Once it's downloaded, open the installer and click Next. Now, Click Next twice to begin the installation. Then, click Finish to launch the terminal. In the terminal, copy and paste this command. You can find it in the description below. Then, press Enter. If it asks for a selection, press Enter again. Then type Y and press Enter to confirm. Wait until it finishes. Now you have the compiler. After the compiler is installed, close the window and move on to the next step. Now, we need to tell Windows where to find the compiler. First, open this PC. Next, double-click on Local Disk C. Then, open this folder. Open this folder again. Now, open the bin folder. Finally, copy the folder path. To do this, Click the address bar at the top. Now, right-click and select Copy. Now, close the window and go back to the desktop. First, right-click on this PC and select Properties. Next, click on Advanced System Settings. Then, click the Environment Variables button. Under System Variables, select Path and click Edit. Now, click New and paste the path you copied. Finally, click OK on all the windows to save your changes. Now let's test if the compiler was installed correctly. First, close this window and open command prompt. Then, type this command and press Enter. You should see version information, which means it's working. Also, try the following commands one by one. If you see version info, the compiler is ready to go. Now let's set up VS Code for writing C++ code. Go back to Visual Studio Code and click the Extensions icon on the left sidebar. Now, search for C++ and install the extension. This gives you all you need to write, run, and test C++ code in VS Code. Now let's try it out. First. Create a new folder for your project. Click on File in the top left corner. Then select Open Folder. In the window that appears, click New Folder. Name the folder, then click Select Folder. Once the folder is open in VS Code, it's time to add your first file. Now, click the plus icon under your folder to create a new file. Name the file main.cpp. Finally, Write this simple C++ program in your main.cpp file. Now, let's compile and run the code. To run your code, click View in the top menu and select Terminal. In the terminal, type this command and press Enter. This will compile your code and create an executable file called main. Next, Run the program by typing dot slash main.
Then, press Enter. Finally, you'll see this output. And that's it. You've successfully set up C++ in Visual Studio Code and run your first program. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like the video, subscribe, and hit the bell icon so you never miss out on more easy tech tutorials. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.